Maybe we're supposed to meet the wrong people before we meet the right one, so when they finally arrive we're truly grateful for the gift we have been given. Maybe it's true that we don't know what we have lost until we lose it, but it is also true that we don't know what we are missing until it arrives. Maybe the happiest of people don't have the best of everything, but they make the best of everything that comes their way. Maybe the best kind of love is the kind where you sit on the sofa together, not saying a word, and walk away feeling like it was the best conversation you ever had. Good morning my gorgeous ghetto. I hope you had a good sleep. I just wanted to give you a small later of thanks. Thanks for always loving me. Thanks for believing in me. Thanks for giving me your wonderful son. Thanks for being a wonderful mother to Adam. Thanks for everything you do for us. Thanks for being my best friend and soulmate. Thanks for always being you. Thanks for putting up with my nonsense. But most importantly, thanks for saving me. Out of all of this, Ross has grew up to be an amazing father to wee Adam. I know he'll be an amazing husband. I'm over the moon that he's finally get to celebrate this big day for you. Ross, I'm proud to call you my brother, and this is a proud moment for me to be your best man. I am truly honoured that you named Adam after me. But to be standing here as your best man on your big day, I'm truly honoured, and I love you, bro. I, Ross, take you, Dorothy. I, Ross, take you, Dorothy. To be my wife. To be my wife. I promise and covenant. I promise and covenant. To be a loving. To be a loving. Faithful. Faithful. And loyal husband to you. And loyal husband to you. I, Dorothy, take you, Ross. I, Dorothy, take you, Ross. To be my husband. To be my husband. I promise and covenant. I promise and covenant. To be a loving. To be a loving. Faithful. Faithful. And loyal wife to you. And loyal wife to you. For as long as we both shall live. For as long as we both shall live. Inasmuch as you have made your covenant together, declaring it before God and your family and friends who gather here with you, I now pronounce you to be husband and wife, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. What God has joined, man should not separate. The Lord bless you and keep you. Ross, you may now kiss the bride. <laughs> Love isn't always perfect, it isn't a fairy tale or a storybook, and it doesn't always come easy. Love is overcoming obstacles, facing challenges, fighting to be together, holding on and never letting go. It is a short word, 
easy to spell, difficult to define and impossible to live without. Love is work, but most of all, love is realising that every hour, every minute and every second was worth it because you did it together.